doing another reaction to independent music. Now, uh, I've done this to a few. If you're on my Patreon, you've seen several videos that I've reacted to. And uh, I actually just finished doing a uh, reaction to a country music song. And you know, I'm not a huge fan of country, but good music is good music. And bad music is bad music. Now, not sure when that one's going to upload. I'm giving uh, Jeff a little time to see the video before it goes live. But a bit ago, I listened to a song, thought it was pretty cool, reached out, and uh, obviously can't do a reaction to a uh, song I've already heard, but reached out to this uh, person, Skin, and apparently Skin is not the person's name, it's Sin. S-C-I-N-N. I just read it as sin. But the S and the C makes... You know, they both make the S snake sound. And, uh... Dude is pretty fucking cool, right? New album he's working on, right? See? Sent me the, uh, sorry. And is sending me some music. So I can have an actual live reaction to. Now, uh, Sin, who's not Skin, I'm... 78 years old, so I get this shit wrong sometimes. But Sin is inspired, sorry, not inspired, but Sin said that many of these particular songs were inspired by Ghost. Good band, actually. I actually like the band even knew who they were and avatar the movie with the blue skin people no oh the really shitty tv show that uh m night Shyamalan made a movie to fix no neither of those i actually had to um ask my niece and yes avatar is a band actually pretty decent um she only played me the one song but yeah kind of cool actually kind of reminded me of ghost so that's a good uh assessment of the motivation behind sin This song is Underworld Whispers. All right, I got to say, this is a fucking absolute awesome 1980s metal album cover and song and actually name. All right, so let's listen to this. In shadows we dwell, deep dark abyss, voices call our name into a haunting mist. <laughs> I'm an old motherfucker, but I gotta say, 
type O negative. Love me some type O negative, Peter Steele. Mm. Dude. Yes. Gotta say, uh, yes. In fairness, when I listen to Ghost, I'm like, yeah. Darkness wraps around, dreams fade to black, blames to the whispers, no turning back. Damn, good lyric. Underworld whispers, calling my name, lost in the void, fueling the flame. Dude, definite fucking European vibes. For the good Euros. Good drums. Creeping slow, twisting thoughts in twilight. Falling below. Love the drums are dancing behind closed eyes. Each hit we take, a part of us dies. Underworld whispers calling my name. That's hard. All right, see, that was an obvious guitar solo, right? Let's just, right? That was obvious fucking guitar solo. But they didn't. Fucking guitar solo. Obvious. But no. Not a guitar solo. Like, yeah. Great fucking change up. Fuck yeah, man. Dig it. Creeping slow, twisting thoughts in twilight, falling below. Demons are dancing, demons are dancing. Close eyes, close eyes. I would have thought it was before. Dies. Underworld whispers, calling my name. Lost in the very, world. very your. I love first time hearing it. Oh, first time hearing it, and I'm pulled in into the flames. Ah. Now, uh, to the American audience, when I say that's so European, you people are going to think Ace of Base, and I'm going to think of Motorhead. You guys are going to think of Electronica. I'm going to think of Romstein, right? Now, I mentioned typo negative. They're American. Yes. 
they're an American band, much like these cats, who took inspiration from the power of Iron Maiden and Motorhead and the electronic European vibe. I mean, go get the Black Bible. Uh, yes, I know it involves the cure, but I fucking love the cure. And, uh, I was in a metal band 450 years ago, and we did, you know, a heavy metal band. Obviously, you do Neil Young, keep on rocking in the free world, and it fucking killed. Bass player hated the song, but it fucking killed. <sighs> We also did a fucking heavy metal version of Sorry, Miss Jackson. <laughs> and I hated it. But the drum parts were fucking... Yeah. Honestly, I would say this is a band of middle-aged European mixed with American metal fans mixed with their kids. So I don't know. Fucking open minded, badass fucking kids who actually listen to their fucking parents that weren't. Cowards and pussies. Yeah. Um, I'm going to close this one off. I'm going to listen to another one. Because I got another one to listen to. Fucking hell, man. I might have a couple drinks and jam some Motorhead. And some Cure. But after the second song, typo negative all the way. By the way, Ghost is fine, good, very nice. Avatar, that song seemed okay. Um, but yeah, they both just make me want to listen to typo negative. Anyways, I'm going to throw the link and uh, check the shit out. Share the love. Or share the hate. Either way, get them some fucking views.